Well, we've, uh, we've seen and discussed the external features of the XL100 color track system. Let's take a few moments now to discuss that other very important part, and of course that's the chassis that makes the entire thing run. The chassis for the color track sets is quite different from what you're used to with the standard XL100 color TV sets. It is a totally new chassis using advanced, sophisticated components that have allowed us to do a great many things that we were unable to do in the past. First of all, from the point of view of service, every set we've ever built has been designed with one objective in mind. Should the set fail, make it a set that is designed so that it can be, the problem can be easily diagnosed and try to get that customer back in business as fast as possible. With that objective in mind, 85% of the components in the chassis are now on plug-in modules modules that are easily removed, but then we've gone one step beyond. For we have taken and combined what used to be perhaps two modules, and we've now put them into one. As an example, this chroma module used to be two. Now, because of advanced circuitry, advanced components, we've been able to combine this or that module into a single module so that, should it fail, once again, diagnosis is easier for the technician, and he can get that customer back in business as quickly as possible. We now have a ferro-resonant transformer so that we maintain voltages regardless of external conditions. And the chassis is tilt-down so that it's easier for the technician to get to. It's divided into three easy-to-understand areas, a power package, where everything that has to do with power is located, a deflection package, and in the center, the signal video package, or that area where the signal of the picture is developed. So not only we have, have we isolated the areas of the set, we have further isolated on modules more of the various functions so that it is easier for the technician to understand what's going on. We have been able, through the use of integrated circuits, and other sophisticated advanced components to put ourselves in a position to develop the most advanced television set we have ever built and yet at the same time make it simpler and easier to service. The color track chassis is something to behold and it's going to make life easier for you and for all of us. By the way, uh, uh, Bob, we were talking earlier of selling strategies as how you would approach uh, the, your prospect as you sell this set. Uh, we discussed various ones. Do you, uh, do you agree with the, uh, or disagree with the step-down approach that we discussed earlier? I definitely agree with the step-down approach. If you start at the top and properly demonstrate the set to, the, to your customer and all the benefits that he can derive from it, then as you go down and he sees the step down, how much he is losing versus what little he is paying in addition to get this set in the color track, I think that's the only way to go. Yeah, Joe. I think you do want to be careful, though, when you're coming, uh, you don't want to kill your other set. It's, it's oh, absolutely not. excellent TV, and the, the only thing you're really saying is this set does have advantages, and yet this is still an excellent color TV, and there's no oh, yeah. reason to say it isn't as good. Remember, they're all RCAs. They're all XL100s. It's just that uh, this is the Eldorado, and those other Cadillacs drive pretty good, you know. For me, I would go the color track first, because I have to show the woman how totally automatic it is, how much easier it is for her right from the beginning. That's what I'm after, though. How are you going to demonstrate to her how totally automatic it is? This is what I'm really after. By, by demonstrating th this particular one first, then going to our XL100, showing her how different, how you work with this one so automatically, how the other one you have to do manually. Okay. What do you think would be the dominant things that you would try to demonstrate to the customer to be able to show them the value of the system? How would you do it? Well, I would try to show the one-step tuning and then explain your automatic takeover from mm -hmm. that system there. You touch it for the first time, and then that's the end of it. I get the feeling you fellas are telling me that things are going to sell. Mm. Oh, I 
Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so I would like to say. Are you, are you telling me you think we've got a good product on our hands? Yeah, I think you've got a good product. Very because so often the parents will say, the set went out because the kids played with it too much. And with a product like you have here, you're eliminating that completely. If I were to summarize everything we've talked about, I think the most important thing to remember is that the RCA XL100 color track system is, is not one individual feature, but a group of features that are electronically designed to work together and to provide a, the consumer with an excellent color picture regardless of light transmissions, variations in intensity, and without the necessity of fooling around with controls. And it's all part of a new chassis designed for easier service and easier diagnosis. Truly, a color TV set that thinks in color. This is Color Track. This year available not only in RCA's new 25-inch diagonal console, but also in a new 19-inch diagonal portable. Here in an affordable portable is RCA's greatest achievement in television excellence. New circuitry and filtered phosphors in an exclusive new tube. Sharper, less noisy pictures. A single control for simple adjustment of color and contrast. Automatic maintenance of picture quality when room light changes. Automatic preservation of proper coloring and flush tones when incoming signals vary. Altogether, this is a remarkable system of advances that gives you a picture in the home whose colors rival life itself. RCA XL100 Color Track, the new television system that thinks in color.